This is Biker Street right here. And the most famous, probably one of the most famous biker bars is right on the left. The Boot Hill Saloon. If you're driving a Honda or something, don't pull in there. I don't think they appreciate it. I don't know. A lot of Harleys right here. This place is swamped with traffic during bike week. Boot Hill Saloon, right across from the Boot Hill Cemetery. You didn't see it, but there's a Boot Hill Cemetery on the right side as we go by a real old cemetery called the Boot Hill Cemetery. And apparently there's actually people buried in there. A lot of grave sites, a lot of stones. I thought the only Boot Hill Cemetery I ever knew of was way out in Nevada somewhere. But we've got a Boot Hill Cemetery in Florida, for sure, for sure. And somebody's buried there. Probably not Wyatt Earp or Johnny Ringo or anybody like that, you know. Just some nobodies like us. I think I want to make a right turn on Speedway Boulevard, International Speedway, and that'd be right here. Because we're leaving Daytona Beach. Because as a single person, the only thing there is for a single person to do is drink beer and hang out on the beach. And when you're single, that gets old. Sure does. If I looked like Tom Cruise, though, I could pick him up and drop him dead on the beach. I could drop him like flies, but I don't look like that, so. I'm blue collar blow Joe. That's all I am. This bridge we go across is going to take us across what they call the causeway. It takes us actually off of Daytona Beach and puts us in Daytona Beach, if, you can, if that makes any sense at all. That behind us was Daytona Beach to Beach. And over here on this side of the bridge is Daytona Beach, the town, and the bus back there. The Metro bus was about to get run over me. On Speedway Boulevard, you drive drive like you're at the Speedway. Believe it or not, that was our big excursion to Daytona Beach. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to tip your waitress. I'll be here all week.